Hey guys, it's me, Dios, and today I'm going to be showing you my stress ball collection. So, all my stress balls is right here in this bin. So, it might not look a lot, but it, it is a lot. I don't remember how many I have. So, in the end, when I showed you all my stress balls, I'm going to show you how many I have. So, let's get started. First, I got this foam stress ball. It has nothing in it. So, it's just foam, so I feel like it's good when you're angry, and it's the earth. It has oceans, it has continents, it has countries, and then, where are we? Where's the United States? There it is, the United States. And then, that's where we are right now. So, then, yeah, I got this one, so I'm just going to put it right there there and let's do oh this red one this one is really soft it has flour in it and oh and i made this so it's diy all i got is a red balloon and got some flour and put it inside and tied it and now i got this so that's nice this one i really like because um, it has beads inside and it makes this a really nice crunchy sound. And this is also DIY. So it's really cool. Let's do... Oh my gosh, I love this one. This one's my favorite. It's a color changing Nido. Pink to purple. And what was I going to say? This is not DIY, of course. I love it. So yeah, this is my favorite. It's just so soft, and I love the colors. Pink is my favorite color. Let's see, what is this? Oh, this is a this is Orbeez filled. So yes, look at those Orbeez, so cool. And then it's a unicorn. Look how fat it looks there. And it's blue, and I really like it. It's just really pretty. So then, that's Orbeez filled. I have quite a lot of Orbeez filled in here, by the way. Okay, next. Ooh, told you. I got another Orbeez, Orbeez filled. I didn't even mean to get this. But this one is purple. So pretty. Love it. Okay, next. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, I love these color changing balls. This one is green. Like a pastel green to yellow. Kind of like the other one, but different colors. And I like this feeling better. Let's see what this one is. Ooh, this might look like an Orbeez world. And it might look like it has water in it. But it does not have water in it. And it's not Orbeez world. It's actually called a DNA ball. And it looks like a gumball machine. So, these ones are fun too. Who doesn't love DNA balls? It looks a little interesting. Okay, anyways, um, ooh, this one, this one I made today, actually, so this one's DIY, and this might not, like, it doesn't feel like there's Play-Doh in here, but there's Play-Doh in here, because the Play-Doh I put in here was, like, a little bit melted, so that's why, because every time I would, oh my god, every time I would play with this Play-Doh, it, it would get stuck to my hand, so I figured... Might as well put in a balloon and play with it in the balloon because it doesn't get stuck to your hand. So yeah, that's DIY. Dropped in twice there. Next, I also got this one. This one's really hard though. This one also has Play-Doh in it. I think it dried up somehow. I don't know how. So this one's DIY. And I also have another one but Play-Doh. Here it is. This one's a different color. Next. Oop. Here's another DNA ball. These balls, um, inside the DNA in here, I guess, is a little bit bigger than these ones here. See, look at the difference. 
And these are also of all different colors. Those are regular DNA balls. And then this thing has like gel inside. It actually feels pretty nice. And I love this color. It's so pretty. So yeah, that's just a random one I got from somewhere. Oh, and this one is similar to the red one, but it's purple. And it has flower in it. And I made it the same way. Um, next, this, is, this isn't really a stress ball, but I put in my stress ball collection. Oh yeah, and I broke that. You could put your finger on, but I broke it. Who's six dollars? Oh, where'd it go? There. So, it feels really good to, um, to toss it around like that. But I like it. You could, like, shake it around. It's very hairy. Next, let's see. Ooh, this one. Um, it's a cat, cool cat. It's a Nido. I really like it because it makes these nice sounds. <laughs> and it's cute. Look how cute it is. I love cats. Cats are one of my favorite animals. Oh, here's another Orbeez spill. It's also purple like this one. So, and it's a unicorn. Kind of like this one too. But a different color. Next. Ooh, this is another Orbeez filled. It's homemade. Hand, uh, DIY. There's Orbeez inside. You just can't see them as well. But there is Orbeez. So, that's fun. Let's see what else there is. Oh, uh, there's another unicorn in here. It's rainbow. So cute. I feel like the Orbeez in here shrink. Yeah, there's more air in here than usual. Yeah, the Orbeez shrinked. Why did they shrink? It's okay. So, I also have that unicorn one too. Next is this one. This one has the enables inside. I think I broke my other one. So, I'm going to put it here, but this one has water, but it's still a DNA ball. DIY. Here's another Orbeez one. Also DIY. Can't see them, but there's Orbeez inside. Next, another color changing ball. This one changes blue to green. Look at that. You just need to mix it up there. See? Uh, next, another DNA ball. This one um, can light up. Just hit it, and there it lights up. Red and blue. So, I also like that DNA ball because it also has spikes. So, nice, nice texture. Ooh, here's my last um, unicorn. Are these filled one? These might be strange too. Oh my gosh. It's okay. So cute. And then next. Oh, here's my other one. Another DNA ball. It also has texture. But it doesn't have a light thing. Next. I have this one. This one is a, this, inside this net, is the same thing as this, but I cut the net off this because it didn't feel good. But this one feels good. Because I also want to have one stressable ball that has this net. Because, yeah. Then the last stress ball in here is the Orbeez ball. Black, white, clear Orbeez. <sighs> and those are all my stress balls, so I'm going to lay them out. So I'll be back just one second. And those are my stress balls all laid out. So now let's count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27 stress balls. I think I counted that right. So, I have 27 stress balls in total. These are my needles. These are my Orbeez filled. These are my um, mesh ones, I guess, but I cut this mesh off. These are my DNA balls, and these are just my random ones here. And then these are my DIY ones. So, I hope you liked this video. If you did, then give it a big thumbs up. Bye, guys!